both candidates in Florida's race for the Senate were in Orlando today. West News Kelsey Thorne caught up with them to see how these final weeks on the campaign trail are going. Representative Val Demings was back in Orlando today, this time to cast her vote in her race for the Senate against incumbent Marco Rubio. Today is a good day. It feels good. We encourage people. It's early voting. You do have a choice and you do have a power. Your voice is your vote. With less than two weeks until Election Day, Demings is making her final push to voters, saying if elected, she will work on issues like inflation, affordable housing, and abortion rights. We have a lot of issues, and there is only one person on the ballot running for the United States Senate in Florida who cares about addressing those issues. Deming's opponent, Senator Marco Rubio, was also in Orlando today. He held an event with the Florida Farm Bureau here at the Carib Royale Hotel. I can tell you, as long as I'm a United States Senator, you're going to have someone up there that's fighting for Florida agriculture. When asked about his final push to voters in these last few weeks, Senator Rubio focused on issues like inflation, energy costs, and crime. I think people know what's at stake. Look, the same party's been in charge of Washington for two years, and everything's worse. Rubio says he also plans to vote early, but has not yet scheduled a specific time. In Orange County, Kelsey Thord, WESH 2 News.